Hey everybody, how's it going? My name is Roger Wolf, and welcome back to Let's Play Paper Mario. In the last episode, we fought through the Dry Dry Ruins to get to this point here, and it's been a while since we played, and uh, I think I fixed my issues, but we're gonna find out. And now, onward. Oh, I remember the voices. <laughs> you're gonna be an old man just because you're a ghost. <gasps> of course. Who else would have no time on their hands? Let's try to scare me instead of doing something productive. You! You ignored all those very scary warnings! Don't you have any common sense to get scared and run away? What's wrong with you? You shouldn't mess with the Toucan Koopa, a faithful follower of King Bowser! Oops, I mean... You shall regret this! Alright, so, uh, Toucan Koopa has about... 30 health, I believe, and his attack power is like 3. He has no defense, though. Uh, what I'm going to do is, instead of uh, doing tattles like I used to do before, uh, they tend to drop the frames even worse if I do that, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a little um, caption above each enemy that comes up, just to get an idea of what they're doing. <laughs> come, chump, come! Bite this intruder! And things are looking fine. Fantastic. Okay, so... Oh my god, it's a change up. So, a few things I want to explain here. Uh, Tuka Koopa will attack, I believe, two different ways. He'll attack with his, the shells he has up there, or magic. Uh, he also summons these Chain Chomps here. Oh, that's weird. And the Chain Chomps have an extremely high defense, which I will also post up for you guys. <laughs> um, let me keep bonking him on the head. Sorry, I'm not totally paying attention here. I'm I keep looking at my screen. It's never helped me out here. Um, yeah, but the frames aren't dropping as bad. Which I need to get rid of this chain chomp fast because the chain chomp. Well, I can get. I have to get rid of him for two reasons. One, because he does a huge drop in my frames. The second reason I have to get rid of him is because he actually does a lot more damage than Tukan Koopa himself does. <laughs> I'm a magical genius. Watch and be amazed. Oh. Oh, right. Okay, he does the rock thing. He can do that as his magic, and it doesn't do a lot of damage, but it can damage your partner, which can be a real pain in the patootie, if you're not careful. So. All right, Chain Chomp's gone. That's one thing. That's one. Ugh. I can speak. That's one less thing to worry about. Okay, I'm not doing good here. Uh. Frippy. Frippy. They're all frippies! Use that. Oh, I know I can do I'll use my refresh power to uh, get myself back in the game here. Alright, so there may be some frame drops here and there. But overall, everything's working fine, and the game's still in audio, I think. Alright, he's gonna do that, which is nothing. Oh, he hurt himself! Yes, he has a tendency to hurt himself, and he can knock himself down, so this actually makes it easier for us to take him out now. Do some four damage there. I'm gonna bonk him. One bonk! Two bonks! Ouch! What are you doing? That hurt! I'm king of the desert! You rude, rude man! Take this! Oh my gosh, he floated back up. Come, chomp! Oh, we're gonna do this again? Alright. Alright, so let's- I'm gonna try something here. I'm gonna Thunderbolt this Chain Chomp. Get a little refund, thanks to that badge we got. That's five damage. Okay, so he has about five health, if I remember correctly. I could've used it on Toucan Koopa, but I thought it'd be a lot better just to get rid of the Chain Chomp right away. Because that, that saves us a lot more time, and then we could just- POWER BOUNCE! Alright. And more bonking of the head! Boink. Boink. Uh, okay, that again. Oh, I got hit into my friend. Oh, this is bad. Uh, I don't want to use that yet. We'll go for another power jump. Oh, we defeated him! That's the end! I think. Ooh! We got a lucky thing. What does that do? 
Oh, double them. Nice. I appreciate that. No! Uh-oh. Ah, oh, come here, chap. Ah, what are you? Oh, help! <laughs> Shininess. Oh, let's get a little bow. I forgot about that. Well, I did my job here. Time to go. No, I'm kidding. Let's grab the car. End of chapter. Thus, Mario and Party unearthed the legendary dry, dry ruins deep within the dry, dry desert. They smashed Tukan Koopa and the wizard and freed Mama. Ma Mama? Is that how you say it? Mama? Mama! The second of the wish granting star spirits. But the enemies awaiting Mario grow ever stronger, and the challenges more difficult. What's in store for Mario and friends? Where will the adventure take them next? Hopefully, someplace colder. Uh, save and continue. I probably shouldn't do that since this is the third time we're trying to record that one part. But whatever. Wa ha ha ha! Ah, hello! How are you feeling, princess? Nothing makes me happier than a smile from you, Peach. That's a lie when you know it. Well, tough luck. I'm in a very bad mood, you monster. You've imprisoned all the guests from the castle. You're the single greatest disaster to befall the Mushroom Kingdom. I'll tell you what, I'll smile when you make everything as was it was before you showed up. Wahaha! <laughs> oh, that's rich. You know I can't do that. Why can't you? That jerk tomorrow just beat two, the beat the Koopa Bros and Tuka Koopa. Wait, how do you know that? I did it like literally a minute ago. Sure, they were complete wimps, but they're still loyal to me. I can't forgive Mario for disrespecting me. Yet you unearthed the house of his potential girlfriend. Dude. I'm nipping this in the bud right now. I'm going to use Invincible Tubba Blubba on him. He's the strongest creature I know. After me. You best forget about Mario. Your nastiness! We have a problem! Why, Kami Koopa? What got you so riled up? You look upset. Really? She always looks upset. Psst, psst, psst. I like that sound effect. What? The stars would have flew away from Tobo's castle! King Bowser, keep your voice down! Princess Peace will hear you! Hmm. Yes, you're right. Tell me the details over there. Oh, I thought they were just gonna go to the other side of the room. That would have been funny. <laughs> That's a little mean to Peach. Twink! You're back! Twink, did you hear all that? Yes, I sure did. The star spirit must have escaped. Did you hear him call that Teleblood thing invincible? That doesn't sound good. You think Mario can win? We better hurry to find out about Teleblood. If we could find something, anything about a weak point, it might just save Mario. Good idea. Then there's no time to lose. We won't get anything done if we stay in this room. Oh, we're on another Peach Adventure! Alright. Let's open this up. A round large fireplace. The fire feels right warm. Oh, alright. Oh, we actually got to leave the castle. Ooh. Oh. Watch Princess Peach. You know you're not allowed in this living room. I'm sorry, but I have to take you back. Oh. Wow, I got captured three seconds in the walking out the door. Greatest ninja ever. I don't even know how long these videos are going to be, but I'm going to start to put them together as well as I can. Are you right, Princess? Did they hurt you? Yes, I'm fine. Thank you, Twink. That's just plain stupid. I gotta be more careful. It doesn't look like you can get through this door. Yeah, I guess it is plain stupid. I just walked in. Uh, a button? Press it. Pressing big red buttons has never been a bad thing. That's what Mario tells me. Alright. Hit the button. 
My audio spikes are ridiculous. <laughs> it's different because uh, on my other recordings I can play from far away, but here I gotta play really close together. The diary's gone. Oh. Alright. So. I will be careful. I didn't use his voice for that one. Alright, where am I? Oh, I'm over here now. Alright, so. I actually don't remember where I'm supposed to go, so this is gonna be adventure for all of us. No. No. Oh, I can't spin. Let's go here. Alright, a dining set. This is actually important later. So we'll, we'll remember that for another time. I can't open the door. There we go. <laughs> no. Leave me alone, sir. This way. Oh, it's a treasure chest? What a beautifully cra crafted treasure chest. Yes, do you like it? This is my mysterious treasure chest that has been passed down through generations of my family here at the castle. Really? How mysterious. A mysterious treasure chest. Uh. That's right. This chest is connected to other mysterious treasure chests around somewhere in the Mushroom Kingdom. <gasps> Ooh. They say you can put things in this chest and take them out of this other chest. Isn't that well mysterious? Yeah, wow, that's really cool. So where is this other treasure chest anyway? Uh, where is it? You know, I can't remember. But, wait, what? I, I don't... I don't follow, Peach. Oh, but we had a badge here. Deep focus badge. When using this focus... Oh, okay, that's cool. Well, I can't use it, so I'll put it in the treasure chest and find it later, I suppose. In here. Uh, like, I, like I said, there's a lot of stuff to here that becomes a little more apparent later. Um, we need a key to open the other door. I guess we go... No, we can't go up. There's a guy there. The guy there. Ah. I need a key. Oh, okay, there's a door here. How did I miss this door, I wonder? There are guards here, too. Probably lots of them. We better be extra careful. Oh, jeez. Yeah. You never thought Paper Mario would be a stealth game. Well, apparently it is. The good news is that Peach is apparently light as a feather and makes no sound at all. And since everybody's 2D, apparently they can't see me. Oh, I almost walked into that one. Man, the 2D world must suck if you can't see everything. Alright, let's see what these guys are up to. Hey, have you heard about Master Tubba Blubba? I heard a rumor that he loves eating ghosts. Oh, no. Ugh, ghost, huh? Master Tubba Blubba, he lives deep inside the forever forest, doesn't he? I think he's gotten the one of the star spirits right now. Yeah, Master Tubba Blubba lives in the castle at the top of Ghosty Gulch. I heard that somewhere near his castle is a mansion with a village full of ghosts. I guess his Master Tubba Blubba sometimes goes there to catch- <gasps> He eats booze! Huh, you think he'd be Mario's friend at that rate. And then he catches one and gobbles it down, starting with its head. Chop. Wait a minute. Aren't booze basically one giant head? I mean... Bleh. Oh man, that's so scary. Now I won't be able to walk to the bathroom alone. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm gonna have nightmares. <laughs> I know it. Why'd you tell me? I also heard a massive time of I was invincible. I'm sorry, I can't get over that. They say he can't be hurt. Nobody can even scratch him. He might even be stronger than King Bowser. Stronger than King Bowser? Come on, that's impossible. Even Master Tubba Blubba has had some weak points. It's just common sense. Yeah, he may be right. There's another rumor that Tubba Blubba's got a secret that would ruin him for him if it ever got out. I bet it's about his past. I heard he didn't used to be strong at all. Shh. What if Tubba Blubba hears you? He might call us up. Still, what do you think that secret could be anyway? I don't know. No one knows. That's why it's a secret, you taffwit. Twink, it sounds like Tubba has a weak point after all. To be like, we're in the mic. If only we could find out. Huh? Hey, did you hear something just now? Gasp! <laughs> you think someone knows goofing off in here? Oh, whoa, Princess Peach, how'd you get here? I'm sorry to do this, but you have to go back to your room right now. You know, these guys are awfully nice for Bowser's minions. Oh, no! Oh, I forgot that item up there. Oh, well, I'll have to do it next time. Wee weep.
Thank you, Mario. At least I can head home to Star Heaven. My name is Mama. Mama! Mama! Mommy! So nice to meet you in person, Heart. You still have got a long way to go, but I know you can save Princess Peach. I'll do my best to help you, Heart. Here's a present for you. Sparkliness! Mario's star energy goes up by two. Mario can now use Lullaby, a new star spirit power. With Lullaby, you can make all enemies fall asleep. Calling me when times are bad. Believe in this, Mario. My powers are strong. I'm a star spirit, after all. Heart. <laughs> Our powers are growing all the time. Keep up the good work, Mario. You must save the other star spirits as soon as possible. For now, I'm going back to recover in Star Haven. Who knows how my dear old Star Haven is faring without the Star Rod. Goodbye, Mario. I'm off. Heart that is dancing. Alright, well, that's going to be it for now. Um, in the next episode, though, we'll move on to, I guess, the Forever Forest, wherever that may be. So, tune in next time. I'm Roscoe's Wolf, and I am signing off.